Well, good morning, Go Church. Rudolf and I are here this morning to tell you about a wonderful opportunity that we have to bless our CAP Debt Centre clients this Christmas. You know, many of us are wondering, what is Christmas going to be like this year on Zoom and uh, with all the restrictions? But for our, you know, for our CAP Debt Centre clients, it's a really tough time. So we thought as a church, we would make it a time, a Christmas to remember, a Christmas where they, that they can enjoy. And so we're going to put together some Christmas hampers and we'd love everyone in the church who can to be involved in that. There are some of us working from home, not having to meet any commuting costs. And actually, you know, we're, we're better off during this period. And there are some who are on further on benefits who are struggling. And so we'd like to extend uh, the giving of hampers, of Christmas hampers, to those in church who are struggling too. So if you know of people who are finding it difficult at the moment, would you share that with the leaders in the church so that we can make sure that we don't miss the people in our church family who need support as well. We need a little bit of help. How are we going to make all this happen? Well, fortunately, we have Alicia on hand this morning who's going to tell us practically how to put this into practice. Alicia, help. Here you go. Thank you, Pizza. Hello, everyone. My name is Alicia. For those that don't know me, I am the center manager for the Captain Center here at Go Church Manchester. And I'm very excited because I believe you want to, to know how you can help us bless our clients this Christmas. Um, so we have taken into account the current restrictions and we know that receiving individual item donations will be very difficult at this time. So uh, we have two different ways that you can get involved. And um, this will be uh, one by doing a online donation. Um, and you will do this to simply go into your church suite app and um, select the captive center and make a donation of any amount. You can start making donations from today and you uh, will be able to make donations until the 6th of December on this so we can have enough time to gather the money and uh, purchase the items that will be then form part of uh, the Christmas hampers that we'll deliver to our clients. We, if we have enough money, uh, we might be able to even bless our clients in other ways uh, by potentially topping up gas and electricity meters or uh, help with purchasing uh, winter clothes or any other needs they might have. Uh, but if online donations is, are not for you and you want to get involved in a different way, uh, you have another option and this will be to pack a hamper. Yes, so you can, as an individual or as a family, uh, decide to pack a whole hamper. As I said, we cannot receive individual item donations, but you can make a whole hamper uh, for a family. So you will buy the items and have it all together, pack it up nicely, ready to deliver to our clients. And if you want to do this, uh, you will be receiving um, an email this week with all the um, different ideas and tips of what you can include in the hamper, what you cannot include in the hamper, as well with my contact information. If you want to pack a hamper, you need to contact me first so I can give you um, some further information about the family or individual that you will be supporting. It's important that um, uh, you have some information and even though we cannot obviously release any of our clients personal details we can give you an idea of the family size if they have children or if it's just an individual so you can then make the hamper more personalized so if you decide to uh, go for this option and pack a hamper you have the same deadline you have until the 6th of December to have it ready for delivery I cannot wait to uh, to see what we can do when as a church family we all come together to bless all this Christmas. So uh, I wait to hear from you. God bless.